Good afternoon, Mr. Tang, Ms. Lee, Professor Shi, Ms. Chan, and distinguished guests. Welcome to the opening ceremony of Happiness in the Making, an exhibition of works by Ms. Rosanna Li Wei Han. I'm Charmaine Huang from the School of Business and Management and your MC for today. Before we begin, I would like to introduce to you our officiating guests for the ceremony. First of all, we have Mr. Tang Hoi Chu, the former chief curator of the Hong Kong Museum of Art and current member of the Culture Promotion Committee at the Hong Kong Polytechnic University. Next, we have Ms. Rosanna Li Wei Han, the artist. And we also have Professor Wei Shi, the acting president of HKUST. And last but not least, we have Ms. Diana Chan, the university librarian of HKUST. And now, without further ado, may I invite Professor Wei Shi to give us the welcome address. Professor Shi, please. Good afternoon, guests and uh, colleagues. Uh, let me just uh, extend our warm welcome to Rosanna and also Mr. Tan, okay? I call you Rosanna because we already met and talked, so I will not call you Miss Lee, okay? <laughs> and uh, Mr. Tan is everything I would picture mentally as a curator in terms of dress and uh, appearance. <laughs> <laughs> you know, many colleagues feel, outsiders feel that, that we are University of Science and Technology, or University of Stress and Tension, which sometimes gives the impression that we may be a little bit dry, maybe a little bit nerdy. I hope with this kind of exhibition, you are convinced that we are not like that, okay? And our library has a very, very special quality. You know, these I appreciate since I came. We have a very good, very friendly exhi exhibition place, and we feature periodically very high quality, but also very personable display. And uh, today I, I look forward to seeing more because uh, I think last two evenings I walked by, I saw many people are working very hard to set everything up. I did see some pictures. These are very humanistic very fun, and I saw books, I have drunk sticks, right? <laughs> I have, I, I saw people a little bit choppier, much more than the artist yourself, okay? Reminding me of the Tang Dynasty kind of uh, porcelain in some way, but the bottom line is uh, it's very, very genuine and uh, authentic. So that I really appreciate as a lay person. Okay, so we have this very good fortune to have the artist and our supporters and many colleagues to be here. And uh, the fact that we have many guests and our members standing around here, it is a very direct testimony in terms of how much we value this and how much I look forward to seeing the benefit to our students and our staff and our colleagues. Now this morning I came to work, everything was ready. Many, many people were already here, okay, around 8.50, okay. They were looking around trying to understand, appreciate, to get a, I think, a sneak preview, okay. So this is a re very direct reassurance in terms of the interest and the taste of HKUST community. So I thank the Rosanna for coming here to let us enjoy this together, and I thank Diana and the Alice to organize this, and of course, Ms. Tan for supporting us. Okay, thank you very much. As I see, uh, Ms. Chen, Rosanna, uh, friends from our arts community, and also ladies and gentlemen, uh, today I have the pleasure to be here at the library of the Hong Kong UST to enjoy the exhibition opening of Rosanna's um, exhibition, Happiness in the Making West by Rosanna Lee Wei Han. Rosanna, I am not disclosing your age. <coughs> Everybody knows. <laughs> but I have known Rosanna for over 20 years. And we worked closely for many projects, including a major exhibition at the Hong Kong Museum of Art to survey the Hong Kong ceramic art from 1985 to 1995, and uh, other significant projects such as the display at the Salisbury Garden and so on. Rosanna is actually a senior uh, art 
ceramic artists who have taught at the School of Design Polytechnic University for 20 years again, <laughs> and brings Hong Kong ceramic art to a new horizon. She is particularly acclaimed for making pottery wares, uh, such as Victorines and also installations, and always sees new inspirations to flavors, not being confined to certain styles throughout the years. Everyone would be very happy to see her fat ladies in festival occasions, as well as other layman figures in the Yunyang cafes. But there are certain elements common to Rosanna's ceramic works. She always pays attention to what is happening in our daily life, her sensitivity to the feeling and present between people and the folk life in Hong Kong. We enjoy seeing her figures of laymen spending their leisure times in the cafes, a typical Hong Kong style of living. <coughs> we are also stimulated by the moderation of the dirty and contrasting representations of male and female, life and death, the old, the old and the new self, and the restructuring of the characters, Chinese characters such as man and woman, to create new playful meanings. As shown in her work series such as Blue or Pink, Double Rock, the Gan Gans and Lao Lao's and so on. I am particularly impressed by Rosanna's thinking of death and life because I know Rosanna has been living in Hong Kong, a very old district in Hong Kong for years. And she pays attention to the what she saw in the Hong Kong area, such as those uh, paper offerings, paper figures in the funeral parlors. And she transformed this sensitive uh, creations into her words. And also, for example, the very impressive series of Thai fat, the old seafood styling fat in the Shang Wan uh, seafood moss. As what Rosanna said, what gives me ideas for my work? The answer is simple, my daily life. For me, ideas for creative works emerge quite naturally from what I see and encounter day to day. So we see that uh, our community members, the families, the tourists, and other people are playing around at her works at the public venues, such as the MTRO stations, the Lei Tong Gai, Hei Tip Gai, and other areas. Mosena's never stops at any point in her artistic career. She continues to explore new creations and pursues further studies in ceramic art. Recently, Rosanna has joined an artist in residence program in Japan to study Shinkaraki ware. <clears throat> and I think this a new experience and also the chances of exchanging ideas between the artists of art from Japan, from Taiwan, and from Korea will further enrich her artistic and diverse in the future. And of course, you can see that in the end of this year, it is uh, her 2018 work, which plays upon the very expensive apartments and mansions in Hong Kong. People just can't afford it. But, and the advertisements very, uh, very strange or ridiculous in a way to have the women, to have the jewelry, to complement this very expensive uh, housing apartments. Here, I would like to congratulate Rosanna for every success in the exhibition, and also thanks to the Hong Kong UST for promoting Hong Kong art for, for years. Now, Chinese New Year will come in a week, and may I here address my sincere wishes for all of you to have a prosperous year of the talk and enjoy the this festival occasion. Thank you. <clears throat> Thank you, Mr. Tang. And may I now present to you Ms. Rosanna Li Wei Han, the artist. Okay. Yeah, uh, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. And my, my, my piece is going to be short, only two pages, okay? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> And uh, uh, no, uh, according to Mr. Tang, then I am actually, you know, I'm not agreed. I, I disagree with him. I'm indeed a junior artist and a senior citizen. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, thank you, Professor Xi. I, yeah, I just got it right. I hope, uh, Professor. And then also thank you, Mr. Tang, and thank you, Diana, the head of the the, the library here. Uh, for lining up the event, and then thank you, Alice, 
And thank you, Alice, for your call. I mean, for your co coordination. Yeah? And uh, in fact, Alice is like a Wang Dai Xin to us. So, yeah? <laughs> yeah, she granted, she granted most of our wishes, which were, which usually are not in demanding. I mean, not. Not, not demanding, right? Uh, until the, what, the day that we approach her and say, could we, we paint a gallery in Burgundy, right? No, now you see it, right? So you know the answer, right? Okay. And then, um, and then it is a, indeed a great pleasure for me to stage an exhibition here. And as you will see later in the hall, then uh, some of the artworks are related to books. And also, uh, and also this title, it came from a very old Chinese good saying. Is this not happiness to study and practice what we have learned? And that is true to me when it comes to making clay or working in clay. It is a lifelong learning and also a lifelong pursuit of happiness. But then happiness would not come, you know, just like this. I mean, I, I owe the Lord from the people who helped me, I mean, behind me. The professional and the committed and devoted teams of workers and also the, uh, all the volunteers. So, so I would like to take this chance to thank them. Uh, Stella Tang, Dr. Stella Tang, where are you, Stella? The, the, curator, the curator of the show, the curator of the show. And also, uh, and then Achi, where are you, Achi? Achi, Achi, he's the art director of the venue. And also KK and Neo, I don't know if she arrived or not, KK. KK and, and Neo, uh, their the company is a, a punishment art creation, right? And then the, uh, Leo and KK led a very good, uh, efficient and really professional team. To, to execute, they, 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 they took care of the art production. And then, who else? And then, and then of course, uh, my, you know, I always get unfailing help from my family and close friends, especially uh, my, my, my sister, my younger sister, Ming. She never turned up for, for the opening, right? <laughs> and and my, 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 my soulmate, or I should say, that my, my best friend, Amy Xu. Uh, uh huh, and and then other people and my my cousin my cousin Amina, no my cousin Amina, and also other other friends like John uh, John my ex student and colleagues right John she's here thank you, and who else? Uh, forgive me give me time this is the only chance I can you know thank them openly. So I don't want to. I don't want to miss anyone, and also, of course, uh, and also, of course, uh, Kenneth, uh, Kenneth, uh, Yanni, Karen, who else? And Tanya of the TA. Is this a TA? TA Communications, right? And I think more or less, right? <laughs> now, excuse me, is that if I if I forgot anybody's name? And dear folks, you know that I mean the friends and relatives and and professional workers that I just na mentioned the names. You know, without you, you know, uh, there's no happiness for me and nothing, I mean, could be realized. So thank you, you know, uh, thank you, 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 I mean, you lovely people uh, for making my dreams come true. And then, I, and really, I love you all. But then last, uh, last but not the least, I really want to thank uh, Ms. Celia Jiang. Is it Celia Jiang of UST? Uh, she's a member of the, of the UCC, I remember the, the coffee, you know, but not the, well, not this, the name of the, com the com committee is Uses Communication Committee. She's, she's a member, and then she recommended me to the, uh, to the library committee three years ago. And then we, afterwards, we, I started working with uh, uh, Diana and Alice. It seemed like a thorough, uh, I mean a marathon. And then last night, we are all here. And I mean, and then dear friends, of course, especially Philin. Yeah? She's flying. Philin, my, uh, my, my ex colleague, she's going to, she's leaving tonight for, for Berlin. Yeah? And she made a special trip here, thank you. And also my, my colleagues uh, in, in, in Poly, too. I mean, everyone, 
uh, by Jolene, uh, by Jolene, and then uh, Happy New Year in advance, and then thank you for being here. Thank you for, uh, I mean, for, for making my day. Uh, you made my day. I love you all. Right? Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much, Miss Lee. And now it is time for the ribbon cutting. May I invite our officiating guests to come forward? Professor Wei Shi, Mr. Tang Hoi Chu, Ms. Rosanna Lee, Ms. Diana Chan. Let's take a group photo first. Okay, and now please get ready for the ribbon cutting. Three, two, one, cut. Yay! Thank you all. And please stay for the souvenir presentation. To express our gratitude, Professor Xi is first presenting a souvenir to Mr. Tang. This map set contains four prints from the library's special collection of antique maps. Oh, okay. 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 Ms. Chan, perhaps you would like to join them for a group photo as well? Professor Shi will now present a souvenir to Miss Lee. <laughs> the book titled China and European Maps is a compilation of antique maps from the library's special collection. Thank you all. And please stay again for some more group photos. May I invite the following guests to come forward to join a photo. Dr. Stella Tang, Achi, KK, Amy Xu, John Sen Zhang, Celia Zheng, Dr. Leslie Lau, Dr. Raymond Tang, Ms. Maria Mack, Feline Brecht, Alice Lowe, Nancy and Anthony Tang. And any friends who would like to join the photo, please come forward as well. <laughs> Thank you all. The opening ceremony has now come to an end. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay.